If I told you you could get a 5.5% interest rate on your mortgage, would you keep watching this video? Well, guess what? You can and you should. Welcome back everybody. If you're new here, I am Bill and I help people make better decisions when moving to, from, or around the greater Charleston area. So if you're into that sort of thing, go ahead and click that subscribe button down below. And if you're looking to make a move in the next three days to three years, I can probably help with that. So let's talk interest rates. Not a very sexy subject and kind of a hot topic right now. I mean, as of filming this, we are at a 7.04% interest rate on mortgages. That is a far cry from where we were a few years ago, around 3%. And today, the Fed is meeting and they're expected to vote to raise rates again. So who knows where they're going to be by the time this video comes out. So how can you fight this? and get a better rate on a home today? Well, the answer is new construction. You see, home builders have this excessive inventory right now, and they're continuing to build more and more inventory, and they're looking to move that. So they do that by way of incentives. And right now, their incentives are insanely lower than average interest rates. I get emails all the time of, Builders offering 5.49%, 5.99% interest rates on their homes if you use their preferred lender. Quick disclaimer on this, you do have to qualify for the lower rate and you qualify for the lower of the high rate and then they buy it down. Um, but if you wanna really know what you qualify for with some of these builders lenders, just give me a call and I will connect you with them and you can see exactly what your rate's gonna be. If it's not that 5.5, it's gonna be significantly lower than what the average rate is regardless. So I know what you're probably thinking right now. Uh, you don't really have the time for new construction and you don't have the budget for new construction, so why does this all even matter to you? So when we look at the entire Charleston area and these single family homes that are for sale, a pre-owned home has a median price of $417,000. Now, a new home has a median price of $440,000. But it's where the interest rates come in that actually makes the biggest difference. So let's start by looking at a pre-owned home of that median price of $417,000 at the average rate today of 7.04%. When you do that math, in principal and interest, you are paying $2,646 per month for that pre-owned home. Now, let's look at a brand new home at that $440,000. Now, that's $23,000 more, but when we use a 5.49% interest rate that they're advertising, you will only be paying $2,000 $370 per month. So when lenders are calculating your buying power, they're actually looking at what you can afford per month, applying that rate and coming up with the final sales price, your maximum sales price. If we can get that number lower or that interest rate lower, your buying power goes up. So now you think that new construction is out of your budget, with the lower rates, it might bring it into budget. So let's look at this a little bit different way. Let's take that $2,646 a month payment for that pre-owned home at $417,000. How much new construction at about 5.5% could you afford to get that same payment? That comes out to right around $490 thousand dollars. So at these lower new construction rates, you can have the same payment and spend $70,000 more. Okay, so I actually just got a notification on my phone that from DR Horton. So one of the home builders in the area, um, my contact there, my friend who works there, here is what they said. I'm very excited to let you know 4.99% is back for a very limited time not available in some communities, okay? Um, they're also offering 7,500 in closing costs and that 4.99% on certain homes, um, VA and FHA only, and closing in September must be okay. 
could push to October if the home's not finished or the loan isn't ready to close. You gotta use their mortgage company and their preferred closing attorney, which is very common when you're getting any of these incentives. Um, and they've got other homes that qualify for a 5.25% FHA and VA and then 5.5% on conventional. Um, what this email also comes with is this PDF here with lots and lots of home. There's 11 pages of homes in that red over there. Those are the discounted prices on some of these homes. These are that quick move in price. So if you want me to send you over this list or anytime I get one of these lists, go ahead and shoot me an email right now. Like don't wait because we can see if there's these 4.99% homes are still available for you. Um, I've created an email just for that. So shoot an email to hotsheet at livinginchs.com. And anytime a builder sends me one of these hot sheets or anything, I will put you on a list to make sure that you get it right away so that you don't miss out on any of these amazing incentives. Now, generally, a lot of people don't have time for new construction. It can take from the first meeting to moving into your home anywhere from seven to 12 months. That's a lot of planning. And a lot of people who just don't have that time. I have clients that do, and I have clients that don't. Well, if you heard in that email, some of these homes must be able to close in September. It is the end of July. That means we're looking at 30 to 60 days for these homes to close. Now, when we look in the MLS, there are 624 new construction homes listed for sale. That is one third of all single family homes for sale in the greater Charleston area are new construction. Of those, 400 of them have already been started and 100 of them are completely finished and ready for you to move in. And these builders have homes that are started that aren't even in the MLS yet. So we can always see what they have. So if you're looking for a home and you wanna close in the next 30 to 60 days, like give me a call. Let's explore these options of new construction because with these rates that they're offering right now, you can get a bigger, nicer house and have a lower payment. Thanks for watching and don't forget to give me a call for all your real estate needs and questions here in the Charleston area. And don't forget to like and subscribe down below. And I've got this video right here that I really think you're going to enjoy. So click on that. I'll see you over on the next video. I'm out.